This is Sonic, and you're watching JD Frank 20. Good day, everybody, and I knew I was right. Apparently, someone did leak the information on Sonic Frontiers, and then some. I did get, I do have the exclusive footage, actually. However, since Sega likes to ruin our fun, uh, I am not going to post a clip. I am not going to post a video on YouTube because you will get a copyright strike by Sega. They're being very very adamant about this and they should the most I can most likely do is just show you uh, the screenshots if I can I think with screenshots we should be okay at least I hope we will so right now what I'm about to talk about right now is dr. Eggman because dr. Eggman yes it start the opening starts with Eggman being inside a uh, being inside the forest it's late at night and he found and he used a, a power gear to turn on basically which is now basically I'm assuming the shrine I'm gonna call them basically shrines to access a uh, cyber world or cyberspace basically that's basically how Eggman discovered uh, the area and he was basically grinting and he was able to activate that that shrine Eggman thought eh, why not let's see what this bad boy could do so dr. Eggman is pretty much amazed and the shrine is already gonna be opened and but what basically happens is uh, he is surrounded by uh, a lot of these high advanced robots Basically, the ones that uh, basically the ones that are we now know are controlled by Sage. Obviously, this is all cool and everything, and that's how basically Doctor Eggman basically got stuck into cyberspace. Most likely, like he made an astonishing discovery with these uh, new robots. Obviously, all, you could almost say it's similar to Boom in a way when he discovered uh, different robots that are not his. But Eggman realized. Uh, something was wrong when he activated the uh, the shrine. He's saying, "Work, you piece of junk." I'm paraphrasing here because there's no, it's not a clear audio. It's just visuals what you're seeing. And then Doctor Eggman got sucked right into cyberspace after the red thing went off. So that basically explains how he got trapped into cyberspace. So no, it was not Sage who trapped Eggman in cyberspace. Eggman trapped himself basically just to get away from being in a in a in a tough situation. You know, he basically just hit the machine and basically uh, he just got sucked right into that. Sucked right into that. So the whole memory theory is BS. I'm excited what I just saw right now. I hope you're all, you all are too. Again, you know, I wish I could share this information with everybody with the video. But right now, Sega is copyright striking everybody who even, play, who even tries to uh, showcase this. So I hope you all understand what I'm trying to tell you. That's all I got to say right now. Let me know what you all think and I got to go. Peace out.